finally the episode you've all been waiting for transit connect episode 50 the van is finally going on the dyno so what's been happening with the van okay so for the last couple of months nothing the van has just sat on my driveway going like a funny shade of green and the battery went flat in fact the battery was pretty cacked it wouldn't even charge back up um, it sat there for ages and ages we pulled it off the driveway last night I changed the map sensor because that went a bit faulty um, so I changed it to a slightly different one um, we went out and done a little bit of live mapping out on the road and we mapped it to a solid bar of boost and it's quite happy at a bar well, it's not happy at a bar but it's running a bar of boost a few little issues arise with that um, the clutch now started slipping slightly which is less than ideal but it should hold out just enough for a power run on the dyno um, the whole idea with this van was it's a completely standard black top 2 litre black top Z-Tec engine as you could lift it out of straight out of a Mark 1 Focus and we've just bolted the turbo to it um, mapped it to a bar boost we can stick it on the dyno and see what happens now the original idea was to keep feeding as much boost as physically possible into the van to see how much power it makes before the engine blows up now a few problems arise with this one a uh, bar boost um, the ignition map is uh, leaves a lot to be desired put it that way there's uh, not a lot of ignition into it flat out at all as you would expect for a high comp engine with a turbocharger but hey the engine costs 100 quid who cares secondly trying to convince someone that you want to put a car on their dyno to map it to the point that it explodes one doesn't look good on them and two it's hard to find someone who wants to agree with it so i've had to kind of beg a bit here but i've actually convinced lee at devil developments to actually do a dyno run on my car so i'm hoping that it don't blow up because he's, he's told me quite firmly that if it does i'm gonna have to clean his dyno so i don't really want to do that um so yeah Unfortunately, it's not gone the way I wanted it to go. You know, the clutch is slipping, the engine's a little bit hanging, it's making some interesting noises. I think it's got like a little end knock or something like that. So, hopefully, it holds up. Um, so, I'm going to put it on the dyno today, see what power it makes, and fingers crossed. So, yeah, stay tuned. What do you reckon, O? 200, what? I'm saying 220 horsepower. Oh yeah, I met my biggest fan today. So what are we doing Clark? We're going for a test drive in the newly tweaked standard engine turbocharged connect. What does that sound like? So we about 10 seconds time. <laughs> I've never been out in this van. I say you've so never been in this van, have I've you? never been in this van. I've heard a lot about it, so. Everyone up here gets the arm with your boot. Oh yeah, no, be careful up here. Where shall I go? You best off going up to Tesco. Oh uh, yeah, I'll go play fucking. <laughs> 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 that would have been ten points. That would have been. Would have been more than ten. <laughs> <laughs> ten years. <laughs> The van made 230 horsepower. It's a completely standard two-liter black top with a turbocharger bolted to it. But I've told you that already. 
Um, I'd like to have put a little bit more boost for it to see how much more power it makes, but the clutch is starting to slip. I don't really want to take the gearbox out to replace the clutch. You know, if I start taking the gearbox out, I want to take the whole engine out and you know, put a proper built engine in it or something like that. I can't really think of anything else I want to do to the van. Can you think of anything else? No. No. Nope. Tell you what, throw me some suggestions. What do you think I should do next to this van? If you start throwing me some suggestions, I'll do it. How about that? All right, so other than that, like, share, subscribe. Um, thanks very much. Till next time. Woo!